Well, tonight a lot of people are talking about the Texas college student who's been trying to adopt a child that he found literally thrown away while visiting Haiti. Fox 26's Gabby Hart is joining us live with the story that you'll see only on Fox. And Gabby, I know this has been a really wrong, a long road for this young man, but he's almost at the finish line. It has. He found that baby in 2017, five years ago in Haiti. I can tell you that he spent the past several years struggling to financially support that child as well as to come up with the costly adoption fees. But it's thanks to the generosity of the public that he's now one step closer to finally giving this child his forever home. Hi, right, guys. Okay. That's <laughs> Meet 27-year-old Jimmy Amisial and now 4-year-old Emilio Angel Jeremiah. Jimmy attended Texas State University as a communications major. In 2017, he went home to Haiti to visit family for the new year. That's where he found Emilio, just four months old, abandoned in a pile of trash. He was uh, so sad to see. I could see him crying, and um, he had no clothes on. Uh, he was naked and um, he had fire ants crawling all over him. Jimmy says because of Haitian superstitions, a group of people surrounding the baby were too afraid to rescue him. No one wanted to touch the baby because they thought the baby was cursed. They were like, it's New Year's Eve or, you know, the devil is trying to get us. But Jimmy, who often volunteers at orphanages in Haiti, says he didn't hesitate. I picked him up from the trash. Haitian officers and a judge came to his family home and they asked Jimmy, just 22 years old and a college student, if he wanted to become the baby's legal guardian. Yay! Even though I didn't know how I was going to be able to take care of him, so I took a leap of faith by saying yes to that. Since taking on the responsibility, Jimmy has struggled financially. He had to take time off from school to help support Emilio and his mother, who's taking care of him back in Haiti. He says the adoption process in his home country is expensive and hidden fees can come out of nowhere. But he says he doesn't regret this journey or his decision to become a single father, not one bit. Whenever he's talking to me saying like, oh, daddy, I need this, I need that, I need a tablet. You know, I want you to buy me a bike. So he has someone that can go to to be asking stuff. So I'm very proud of that. Yeah, now Jimmy started a fundraiser that has raised more than $60,000, meaning he finally has enough money uh, to go ahead and complete the adoption process. He tells us that any excess funds will be used to help him finish college and to support little Emilio's future. Uh, if you'd like more information about that fundraiser, you can head over to my Facebook and Twitter pages at Gabby Hart News. For now, I'm reporting love. Gabby Hart, Fox 26 News.